Okay, now tell us who you are. My name is Mike. And, uh, and where are you from? I'm from Chicago. I was born in the suburbs. Okay. I heard that you uh, did a triathlon last year. I did. I did the 2008 Chicago triathlon. And what did you, how did you decide to do it? Oh, one of the main reasons was to lose weight. Basically, I went to the doctor and I had a little bit of high blood pressure uh. and he wanted me to lose a little weight. And one of the big motivation factors is to do a triathlon and actually I previously did a marathon and I wanted to challenge myself even more by doing a triathlon. And how was training like? Training was pretty intense. It was uh, a lot of running at first in the mornings and then building your my building my endurance up to get uh, a lot of uh, endurance training for the swimming part. Mm -hmm. And then once I got my endurance, I trained for swimming. And then after swimming, I trained with biking. So all those three combined, it was pretty intense. Because even doing it, you would have to train even twice a day, like waking up in the morning and going to work, and then working out after work. So there were a couple times where I was so exhausted during training. What, uh, did you have any breakthroughs while you were going through your training? Some of the breakthroughs, I guess. One of the major ones was uh, when I was swimming and realizing that when you're swimming in Lake Michigan that sometimes you can't really see where you're going. And when I swam, I only breathed to my right side. So when I swam and looked to the right, there was just open space. You couldn't see anything. So I had to teach myself in the pool again to breathe to the left and the right. And so I could finally see the direction that I'm heading in. So once I figured out how to do that, then I got my endurance to actually swim in a straight line in Lake Michigan, which is pretty dirty. <laughs> What about uh, how did it how did it feel when you actually completed it? Oh my gosh, <laughs> it was so good. It was just it was rewarding, I guess. So all that hard work really paid off, and just finishing the swim part initially was amazing because that's just there was just so many people around, and I didn't think I can finish it because I'm not a natural swimmer and. So just having so many people around and finishing the swim part and then finishing everything was was amazing. Well, we've got some footage later that will show of you swimming. Right. <laughs> but what would you say to someone who is thinking about doing the mar the triathlon or marathon but hasn't done it before? Oh my gosh, do a lot of research. <laughs> it's a uh, a lot of grueling, intense training, and if you're doing a lot of physical labor at work, that's another thing to keep in mind because if you're getting exhausted during work and then getting exhausted in training, that's going to be very difficult to do. Are you going to do it again? I'm definitely going to do it next year. <laughs> so, 2009, actually this August. Oh, fantastic. So definitely planning. Okay, well, Mike, thanks for joining us today.